Um, in terms of, of where we are, Dr. Gomez mentioned that we had 13 COVID-related deaths. This is one of the issues I want to, to clear up. We term COVID-related deaths because we test persons who die for COVID-19. Our patients who've passed away, our people who've had, and I want to make it very clear, one death is too many. Our plan from very early was to contain the cases, reduce spread, because we are aware that we have a vulnerable population for COVID-19, and part of our plan is the strengthening of our patients with chronic diseases and our elderly to protect them, to reduce and to prevent them from getting sick because one death from COVID-19 is too many for us. So the 13 is too many. But we use the term COVID-related death. I want to make that very clear. I am at no point saying COVID killed somebody and I am not saying that nobody died of COVID. Our patients have other underlying conditions, our patients that we have had to date, a range of other underlying conditions which could have also caused their death. Now, it is a known fact that COVID-19 exacerbates an already existing health condition. It makes it worse. So I am not in a position to say COVID killed any one of them or to say it is not COVID. What, I, what we are saying, this person passed away and was positive with COVID-19.